So I always find it interesting. So I had this conversation with a guy on Facebook that was arguing with me over anti-seize on wheel studs. He's saying it's not a big deal. I said, well, what happens is it tends to over torque it. So let's say you're going 80 or 100 foot pounds, uh, you're gonna be using way more clamping force, which could break the stud. So here we go, Monday morning. Customer brought a vehicle in and ended up breaking a stud on his Toyota RAV4, right? And he didn't understand how it happened. So I started talking to him. Actually had moved up every single stud with WD-40. So this stud actually ended up snapping. So it wasn't cross-threaded in the nut since we were able to get the, the stud out. But look at that. You see how wet it is inside there? That's what happens. He said he was torquing everything to spec. But as you can see, to get to that 80 or 100 foot pounds, whatever he was going to do it to, took way more clamping force and ended up breaking the stud before it ever reached the proper torque. So do not lubricate your wheel studs. It leads to over torquing.